both pause went up and again oh, thank you thank and it, you wow wow Oh my god, I'm sure that just said Lesson now books out in a woman's voice. Like a kid. What was that? Turn that down. That was the loudest bang behind you. Turn it down. Random words. Yeah. <clears throat> and obviously it is on a phone. Again, you know, leave us a call. <laughs> Thank you. Proving okay. 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 okay, so tonight we've come to investigate an old school or an old Victorian school and an old chapel that sits just behind Rion there. So the building had m multiple uses um, and was in use as a school and as and a chapel from 1870 until the school closed in I believe 1967. Um, so I believe this area here would have been the classroom and then behind is the main area of the chapel here. So um, we have got other rooms to go into as well and the old um, head teacher's house or the old schoolhouse is just beyond us here. I think that's empty at the moment um, but it is a house that's on the market um, but, so we shouldn't get any noise contamination but we'll just have to wait and see for that. Um, this was also a settlement for the Knights Templar, this area was, and then later the Knights Hosp Hospitalia. Um, on this site here, there did used to be a chapel, and I'm going to absolutely butcher his name now, but there was a chapel lane, so I believe that's someone who kind of conducts a service and everything at the chapel, called John Bogus over here, and he, he actually... did very well there. It was something <laughs> like that, anyway. And he actually killed his uh, clerk at this site in Onnelly. So it's quite interesting, really, and... Um, not sure. I mean, I don't. This place has never been investigated before, so we're totally in the dark on what we're going to get tonight. Um, but we brought some equipment along, and we're hoping to make contact with either some of the children that used to come to school here, or perhaps them that came for worship and other services that would have took place in this church. But we're just going to do some baseline tests in a minute. Um, but I do want to give a massive thank you to all our subscribers. We have just hit the thousand marks so we're oh, yeah. Really, yeah, really, really <laughs> happy with all your support, you know, from the very first one to the most recent one, you know, we love all your support and oh, thank definitely. you so much for that. And it's just going to keep us making want to make lots of more great content in, I think, 2022, you know, we're going to have loads more investigations on the channel, so be excited to see what we get tonight though. Um, if you do see or hear anything that we miss at all, please drop us a comment below and also if you've got any tips or advice or things you'd like to see on the channel happily comment away or any bits you know of uh, constructive criticism we're happy to accept that as well so Definitely. just anything like that bring to the channel um, and if you do enjoy this video just hit a tap there. I heard that. Thank you. Thank you. Quite a lot of time. Yeah. I feel like we're getting some presents already. If anyone is here with us now, can you give us two loud knocks? So I had two taps from over there. See, I just heard one. Was that you? Yeah. Good. There is my label on my hoodie. Ah, <laughs> I need to cut it out, to be fair. Yeah. What I might do as well, just so we've got some of the equipment set up, um, kind of remind them how it used to be. I'm going to set up the um, piano there as well in a bit. Yeah. Well, not set up, but just open it up to see if we've got mm -hmm. any keys played on that throughout the night. We'll hopefully do a locked off camera and uh, just wait for it to get dark now, really. Oh, definitely. So we can be able to have shut the curtains here so we don't get any light. Um, like street off lights the or yeah, anything. Try and blank any of that out. Um, but what we'll do, just go around with the K2 meter and see if we get any activity. And also to debunk any possible natural sources mm -hmm. of electromagnetic field. So there's a new gas fire and 
put in there, or an electric fire, I should say. But it's too... That was me on the floor. So these look like the original seats from when it was from a chapel, church, yeah. which is very impressive. Another small electric fire there. But what we'll do, we'll just get it into the other room as well. Yeah. So we might set that up, table up later to do a spirit board on. Oh, that's a good idea, Possibly actually. Up in there, a couple of chairs. Good thing is I'm not getting any contamination on this at the moment. Yeah. Um, I believe this could have been a second classroom in the school because it's definitely part of the original building. Yeah, definitely. You can tell like in the roof area. And then the toilets would have been the original probably mm -hmm. from school. Yeah, I think that's uh, the tour. So it's not a big location. Yeah. But it's certainly got a lot of character and a lot of age to it, which I And a lot of history as well. Yeah, yeah. I'm interested to know if the, the Knights Templar um, from the area is still busy to you as well. I'll have to see what we have. So, yeah, what we'll do, get all the equipment out, mm -hmm. get set up, and then just wait for. Uh, like, oh, we haven't really shown up here, have we? Yeah, before we That's get true. Up. Got a mouse trap on the floor. Like <laughs> That'd be interesting when it gets that. dark. Another part of the original church furniture or chapel furniture. Um, and then the actual altar and everything here still. Mm -hmm. so it's got a lot of stuff on at the moment, but you can see where it would have all been, been set up. It's nice how like the altar and stuff is still here. Definitely, definitely. Really good. Mm. That's me, by the way. I always make that mm. noise when I'm just showing an interest <laughs> in something. It does sound a little bit paranormal. Yeah. You know, so <laughs> bump me in for voice there. Straight away. Mm. Yeah, we'll get set up. Mm -hmm. get into it. Can you come to this green light on the table? If you want us to try and interact with you later on this board. You. Thank you. Camera should have picked that up over there. Hopefully. So that's a school area, so we have set up a bear down there. Um, just and a creepy as a, doll as yeah, well. Yeah, I've not actually turned that on yet, uh, but I'll add that on in a bit. Do you want to head over to us and try and communicate to us through this board? Some balls on the floor on the way if you want to push them, none of this equipment will hurt you at all. Well, can you light up the, up the bear again? We'd really appreciate it. If you could pull it off that bench, that would be really impressive. I mean, that's really good evidence for me that that's all the way over there. Mm -hmm. There's no... You know, there's no wind contamination no. in here, there's nothing at nothing. all. And that's just randomly gone off. Mm -hmm. I and mean, you know, it doesn't just go off, no. uh, it's got to be touched to go off. So, thank you for that. Thank you. Okay, so we've just done a quick Ouija board session, and um, we've not actually captured anything um, on the board. When we were doing it, the red bell went off. So you actually have to go up and literally yeah, give it a good squeeze, squeeze there. Okay. Yeah, we'll settle down the mega. Mm-hmm. And then on the other old uh, church chair there, just watch the ball on the floor. Okay. So this is the creepy doll. Yeah.
Mm-hmm. Yeah, so the electrostatic is going off there a bit from mm-hmm. your touch, so you have got to touch it. Yeah. It doesn't always work when you touch it. No. Oh, bear's gone off. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Do you know how to use that then? So that's twice I've activated that. And then we have got two spirit balls set up. Just in front as well. Side. Yeah. Could you but touch... Yeah, I really don't like that doll. No, no. <laughs> Could you touch that bear again for us? It won't hurt you as you've seen. So it did actually touch two of the paws then. Oh, did uh, On the right hand side of the bear. Uh, Both paws went off. And again, oh, thank you. Thank and you. Wow. Wow. A big orb and it's right. And again, oh, thank you. Thank and it, you. Wow. Wow. A big orb and it, it was going so slow. It's just come up from the bear as well then. Really? That was really good. I've gone freezing yeah. after seeing that. Thank you so much for that. You're welcome to play around with that as much as you want. We come here as friendly people and we just want to communicate. Yeah. So although I've got no kind of official records, or I can't find any official records of any deaths on the site, um, we do know that the former headmistress um, did actually die about, about 32 years yeah. ago, maybe a bit more. Um, Is and, that a picture there? I think as a child, yeah. Yeah, yeah I won't... Uh, I'll just try and get it, but without the name. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so that's a picture of the old headmistress as a child. Um, I feel like we're communicating possibly with a child spirit I here so. with the interactions. Now, obviously it was a school between 1870 and 1960. Now, unfortunately, back in the Victorian times, a lot of children did die at younger ages through disease and things. So there's a very strong chance that maybe some of the children that come to this school actually didn't, you know, get to finish school. Unfortunately, she's very sad. And yeah, oh, thank you. Thank you. So maybe that's interacting with us just to confirm that. Um, if that is the case, could you touch it again now for us, please? If you still like coming here. anything we'll include that in the, the footage uh, but yeah we'll run a spirit yeah. box see if we can get any communication so if there are any spirits with us can we see your name through this device or just a simple yes that's a Chris I think yeah. it's a Chris Chris, is that you? Are you here with us now, Chris? Sure, it said 47. Mm. And you didn't ask for an age, but... See, I was thinking, next question, to ask the age. Ask the age, yeah. I mean, and that is it. Go on, sorry. I don't know, some spirits, and it's almost like, use your mind, as to what yeah. you want to ask for. That might have just said, as you were saying that then, I, I hear what you think, or something like that, I hear I think. Can you tell me, say, how many spirits are here with us? Ten past seven. <laughs> That's the time. <laughs> that was weird. No, it's not ten past seven. I thought it was ten. No, it's... That, did that just say ten, ten past seven? I thought it said ten past six. Hmm. I'll check that back. Mm-hmm. No, I won't. That just said. Mm-hmm. No, I won't.
Este... ¿Cómo está? If there is a Chris here with us, can you try and say Chris again now? He's got a good oil over down there. Lassen. Mm -hmm. Come on, I said Lassen. Did you like school? Oh my god, I'm sure that I just said lesson now books out in a woman's voice like a head teacher. Really? I'm gonna have to check that back, but it sounded like lesson now or listen now books out. If there's a teacher here with us now, can you try and let us know? Can you try and tell us your name, teacher? Miss, we think we heard you then. Can you try and tell us your name, Miss? Yeah, if that was, if that did say what I believe it did, that is some compelling evidence. It was a lady in a almost a Victorian sounding voice saying, listen now, or we'll listen now, books out. That was brilliant, if it was that. Yeah. Oh, that was a lady again. She just spoke. You come forward as a gay miss. What was that? Turn that. What was that? Turn that down. That was the loudest bang behind you. Turn it down. I heard that. Thank you. Thank you. Could you do that again for us? That's like a bum. Yeah. I do keep hearing taps from back there. Yeah, I mean, one of them is really consistent, so... It could be... Something natural, yeah. you know, I don't want to... want to say it's definitely no. paranormal. Um, but like, got a few orbs, the bear going off. If you could do the bear for us now, on command, that would just let us know that you were definitely here with us. Yeah, we'd really appreciate it. Do you go and touch the bear now for us, please? Or any of the other, the doll or the balls? Was that you? Yeah, that was my foot. <laughs> Jesus, I thought they were like really, really <laughs> clear footsteps then. <laughs> if you go walk up in the church part or in the chapel part, 
That will also let us know you're there. Those red dots. Go and see if you can grab one. See what happens. Go and try and touch one of those red dots for us. So I do want to run a little bit more spirit box just because yeah. that lady's voice. Um, but what I'm going to do, because mm -hmm. we haven't set up, well we have set up the locked off camera but I just want to start recording on that now as yeah. well. Um, no, so I'll go, go sort that out, yeah. Mm -hmm. Now it's like pitch black. So uh, we'll just sort that out first. The spirit that touched that bear before the child come forward now. Touch the bear again for us, please. Try and talk to the bear. The bear can be your friend tonight. Oh. oh, thank you. Thank you. I'm hoping we've got some on this now then. Yeah. Yeah, because that's literally... I've gone freezing cold again as well. Yeah. So that's interesting. Right, I'll play this. Mm -hmm. Why have you said blood to us now? Can you tell us whereabouts in this building there was blood? Did you say before someone was killed here? Yes, that's a very good point. Um, can't remember his name, but in the old, when this used to be in Knights Templar Chapel, um, many years before, I think it was, the earthworks are still very close to here, mm. um, but it was the chaplain uh, I think that's how you pronounce it. I presume he's like the priest of the chapel. Yeah. Um, actually killed his clerk. Now some say it was a disagreement. Others say that it was just brutal murder. Mm -hmm. And others say it was in self-defence. Um, we are getting a few lights coming through. It's just through the top. I can't do anything about no. that, unfortunately. Um, but it's not knocking the shadow detector off. No. So that, that's looking uh, really kind of clear at the moment as well over there. Yeah, what can you tell us about blood? Whose blood was spilt here? Yeah, that tapping then? I know I was moving my hand on the holder. Elderly. Elderly. Is there any elderly people in the chapel? Who's an elderly person here? We need a name really before we can continue. Can you try and tell us your name? I 
you can choose any word from this device that's on there. If your name's not on here, try and whisper it into the camera for us. Use our energy, if you need some energy, you're welcome to come forward and use our energy. Yeah, we've got plenty for you to use. I do feel that it's just gone a little bit flat. Yeah. I mean, you can't expect activity all the no, time, don't get no. me wrong, but what was happening in here before, I felt a build up and now I just feel like it's gone like a bit it's deflated. Gone away. Yeah. Please come back for us. I mean, it is getting late now, you know, mm -hmm. is it too late for the children? And also you've got to think, as this is the first time it's been investigated, Yeah. they're not used to yes. using energy. Axe. So we've had blood and we've had axe. axe. Now, was a clerk killed by an axe? An axe would be a tool that they would have used back yeah. in the Knights Templar days. Bracelet. Bracelet. Do you have your axe? Yes. Yeah, I've axe, got... bracelet. An axe again there. Thank you for that. Thank you. If we're speaking to the Knights Templar now, or someone from the Knights Templar, could you try and say night for us or yes? Just so we know we're communicating with someone here. Yeah, as I was saying, because this is... Axe. Axe again. Axe again. Because this is the first time this place has been investigated, Obviously, the spirits aren't used to communicating and using energy. No. So it might be that they've gone to rest. What What's your opinions on the likes of Ghost Tube Spirit Talker? I mean, we get some fascinating results, yeah. don't get me wrong, but looking at it in a sceptical mindset. Number one, it's a phone. Yeah. Okay. Now, I get if it's a recent spirit, knows how a phone works, you know. But anything prior to the 21st century, so 2004, mm -hmm. well, 2005 and before, really, before phones started getting kind of smart and everything, how would it know how to use it to start with? And then for it to then pick words out from a device that it knows nothing about. Yeah. I might be throwing a complete damper on mm. this now. I mean, I've had some <laughs> good results on these apps, but I don't know. See, I'm literally 50-50 on the fence mm. about it, because we have had some really good responses. That have been really relevant. <clears throat> yeah, but then we've had a load of gobbledygook that doesn't make sense, random words. Yeah. <clears throat> and obviously, you've it is on a phone. Again, you know, leave us a call. <laughs> Thank you. Prove me okay. wrong. Okay, okay. <laughs> I was just about to say to the camera then, please let us know, you know, your <laughs> thoughts on these kind of apps, these like word generated apps. And then we get to school. Ah, I'm speechless there. Same. I'm ah. still on the fence, but that is. <laughs> Amazing. You can say chapel now. <laughs> I will rest my case. Same. Buried. Buried. Chapel. I like it. I like it. Bloody. Bloody again. We had bloody axe and buried. Now, the interesting thing is about this chapel, mm -hmm. I know that there's no kind of graveyard no. outside. I'm just wondering whether 
Keep used to going. Be, I will. <laughs> Whether, <laughs> when it used to be a church or chapel in use, maybe the car park now outside is where the graves used to be or in a close by field. Possibly. Um, or that used to be the children's playground out there. Mm-hmm. That would make more sense yeah. if it was a children's playground. Uh, that was so interactive then. It this was. is on flight mode. You know. Why? Oh, stop me on my tracks. Out. Living room. That's the living room for the house. Uh. The schoolhouse is built on the side. Which believes derelict at the moment. I think mm. it's for sale. What word did it say before living room? Why? Why? Like in, why am I here or something? I'm here to speak with someone, uh, to communicate, to see if there is any spirits in here with us now. Uh, we've had some great interactions on the bear, possibly some communication through the spirit box, but we really need a name from you. Change. That's saying we should change again, possibly. Possibly, or... or... Change, what can we change? See, this is where it starts losing me, mm. it's really relevant. We do need a name though, please, before we go any further. It just lets us know who we're communicating with. And I might be able to kind of piece together the puzzle from that. Yeah, if we tell you our names, and then you tell us yours. So my name's Rianne. My name's James. Attic. Attic. I don't think there's an attic. Uh, it could be through any other part. Although, there is an attic looking hole thing up there. Yeah, definitely an attic. Times two entrances, but we have no way of getting up there. No. Can you come oh, free? <laughs> Can you come down from the attic? Or if you are in the attic, can you make two loud footsteps like this? So we're going to run uh, a Ouija board now, or a spirit board, and just see if we get anything on this. So I'm going to pop the planchette in the middle there, and then we'll go around the board in a minute. Oh. Just obviously very, very gently, because mm-hmm. we don't want to move on the table. Keep going four, five, that's just me on the table. It's really weird then, the letter seemed to move on the board, I've never seen it. Really? It might have been my eyes playing tricks, but it looked like, it looked like the letters from J and all the way around to P and yeah. the just floated. So, if there are any spirits with us, still, can you try and either move the panchette to yes? To indicate you're here with us now. Mm-hmm. Or if you can, point it, move it to the first letter of your name.
Okay, Spirit, you've got two ways to communicate to yeah. us now. Either through the board or through the box there with the lights on it. Can we please ask you your name first? Do something big for us, please. Just to let us know we've not been alone tonight. We are very grateful for the responses you've already given us. <clears throat> and before we go, we would be ever so grateful if you could do one last big thing for us. So it could be saying something through the spirit box. Communicating from the Ouija board, obviously my snot from the balls, the bear, the doll. That might be down to crying. Yeah. Child's voice. <laughs> you can feed off our energy if you are struggling. We've got plenty. Trying to. Mm. Who's trying to? My name's James. And my name's Rianne. What's your name, Spirit? Forward now for us, please. communicating with tonight. Something just tried to touch me. Someone just tried to touch me. Thank you for trying to communicate with us. Thank you. I'm going to say goodbye for now. Let's see, see ya. Possibly. You say goodbye for us. <laughs> that, there was a tune there a couple of months ago. Yeah. Hey, you heard something on that. I know, well it's done. Well done. <laughs> well done. Okay, we're going to go now, thank you. Goodbye. Thank you, goodbye. Summer. Goodbye.
You say goodbye, Buck? <coughs> I hear, I, I'm sure I heard yeah. like, a, like a little bell ring. Mm. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Last try, uh, last try, last <laughs> chance. Try and communicate with us through the board now. Did you just push it then? Possibly. Ah, because it moved over towards the goodbye. I can feel you trying to move this now. I think it's gone numb. That might have been what was moving it then. Yeah, I can't actually feel my finger because it's gone. That's off. Infamous tap there. Mm. It's Although it's not happened for a while. No, that's true. No, it's happening more yeah. frequent. Come forward. If that is you, can you make two consecutive cons consecutive it. knocks? That's the one. Can you repeat this? <clears throat> yeah, should we end this yeah. session? Yeah, we're going to say goodbye mm -hmm. now. Goodbye. There is a lot of shadow activity there. It Again, could that's just a be the, there. Yeah, it could yeah. just be the lights. Yeah. Obviously thinking it's shadows. Mm. Should we just do some call outs now yeah. just to kind of finish mm -hmm. up and then wrap up from there. So we're going to be going shortly. Um, we're hoping that we've caught a bit more on the camera of your presence with us tonight. If you could do something for us now, we'd really appreciate that. Try and make us jump if you can. Maybe say goodbye by making one of the balls or, you know, you've lit up the Ren Bear tonight. Maybe you could say goodbye that way. I do get the feeling that whatever was here before, which there was, you mm. felt that was something yeah. strong, has now gone. Yeah, definitely. Maybe it's gone into the other room. Possibly. Maybe we were catching quite a yeah. bit through there. Uh, the bonus of obviously having a locked off camera. Yeah. Um, but interesting place. Definitely. I think, um, I think we will come back. Mm -hmm. It was just the back of the chair. I thought someone stood next to the tripod then. <laughs> Um, I think obviously because we're the first people to investigate it, mm -hmm. I don't think the spirits perhaps, you know, know how to interact yeah. yet or, or have understand any yeah. of the equipment or things like that. And we're kind of been here to kind of try and help teach them tonight, yeah. that they can communicate to us and that there are friendly people out there that will, you know, mm -hmm. try and um, just get their stories yeah. and events. Um, but yeah, this has been the the old Victorian chaplain school. Yeah. <laughs> uh, thank you so much for watching. <clears throat> yeah, thank uh, you. Again, if you have seen or heard anything we've missed, please comment below. If you've enjoyed the video and, um, you know, you can support the channel by dropping us a like. Mm -hmm. Or if you are new, uh, subscribe to us or consider subscribing if you've enjoyed it. And we'll have uh, plenty more content coming soon. Definitely. Yeah. And also check out our Facebook, Instagram, and we are now on TikTok. Yeah. 
so, so some short time yeah time. please go check those out as well yeah. as our youtube channel um there'll be secret little content on there um behind the scenes pictures so yeah check that out mm -hmm. goodbye for now thank you thank, thank you. you for watching